But in many ways, we are because first, Fallon Fox was and Fallon Fox still is a legend and a fighter that Outsports Zig Ziegler called the bravest athlete in all the sports. And you know, you can make a pretty compelling case for that statement. I had a chance to talk to Fallon after the game and Fallon noted the level of acceptance in football is something that was a pleasant surprise for her. Wow, it was really amazing um, to watch you get out there and like, you know, actually just like, you know, it just felt like you're out there taking the torch from me. You know what I'm saying? In a way, Alana took that in MMA and like now you're taking it in football. It's like, you know, just that continuous, you know, thing for trans athletes. So, yeah. So, how does it feel for you to have, not have so many progeny out there? Because huh? in many ways, whether people, people... Even if they don't acknowledge it to your face, they know. They know uh -huh. who found, They know that because Fallen Fox did, the door was open. What does that feel like for you, knowing that hey, the the those that came after you, oh they're still God. doing it, even in these difficult times that we're in right now. Yeah, I mean things are tough right now. You know, I don't even know how many more more, more years we're gonna be able to do this. <laughs> Be honest, you know, hopefully this continues, but it feels really good to see like so many transgender athletes, especially like you right now. Like you know what I'm saying. Thank you, Fallon, and thank you, Ambush. And in 2025, I'll be back.